What is going on guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. So I've talked a little bit about Chantal past couple days and how it's relatively clear she's trying to find direction with her channel and what she wants to do. And I think so much of this is based on the fact that she's went through so many different rebrandings, right? So today she is foodie cutie. Now, the reality most of us understand is these rebrandings aren't about growing as a creator. They're not about trying to expand her audience. They're about trying to separate herself from reaction channels and the things that she's done in the past. So today, we see a different formula of video. And I've often said, I think Chantal looks at what other channels do and then tries to find a way to make that successful for herself in disregards the concept that it does take talent to actually create watchable content. So to her, couples channel is as simple as her doing a couples channel. ASMR channel, simple as her doing an ASMR channel. That's all there is to it. All she needs to do is apply her name to a fundamental concept that is working for someone else and inherently she will find success to her. But we know in the past we can look and see this has not been the case. There's multiple things she's attempted that have not panned out. Be it she stopped, be it she didn't see the success, be it she just wasn't good at it. So today, I wasn't aware of who Kate Yup was. Christina actually told me, you need to look at this person's channel and see the similarities. And I have to say, it's pretty striking. If you look at what's happening here, you can make a clear-cut case that Chantal simply watched another successful YouTuber and said, I'm going to do this with my audience, I'm going to create this type of content, and I will find success. When you look at the way these videos are composed, when you look at how they're shot, when you look at how they're edited, when you look down to the time constraints, there is no doubt about it. She clearly was inspired once again by someone else making content and then simply feeling that if she does it, she will be able to turn it into profit. The reality is Chantal has her own audience, a unique group of people that have watched her slow train wreck, for lack of a better term, and many of them don't want to watch her new diet of eating food in copious amounts for 10 minutes. Love to know your thoughts on this, though. Appreciate you watching it. You know I will be back as soon as I can with more content.